Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Buck. Buck just got here. Simon is on that tree. I just gave him a few peanuts. Well, Buck is blocking him now. <laughs> Thank you, Buck. And then I have Thumper right there. I offered him some corn. Get your peanuts. I know, Buck, you're ready. Yeah. Buck is ready. Buck is like, I'm ready. I'll throw two more peanuts to. All right. I gave Simon more peanuts. Now Simon's gonna go searching for them. All right, I just gave him a cashew. I gave you more peanuts. You gotta go find them. Look at those cheeks. Now he's gonna probably smell the other ones I do. No, no, go the other way. The other way, not here. And Buck's over here eating breakfast. So everybody's eating breakfast this morning. Everybody's here. And Thumper, the cutie pie, is right there in the same spot. Has he been every day? Buck, you just dropped something. Hold on, guys. It smells a little crazy. Buck is dropping stuff. Look. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's okay. Because I put my phone in his face because he was like, what is that? Yeah, baby. Come on. What, now you want any bucket? It's okay. It's okay. Come here. So Buck is having his breakfast. Simon just went to go bring his peanuts home that I offered him. Thumper's over there eating corn. Thumper's been at that spot, running to that spot. Thumper's like, you know what? I'll stay here on this side. Nobody bothers me. Nobody walks towards me. And he gets to eat in peace. And Simon will be coming back too soon for more peanuts. The grass grew so much, like everything that we planted. It's growing, it's getting greener. It's getting greener on this side. Right, Buck, it's getting greener. And the grass is starting to grow there too. It's taking a little longer, but I see green cropping out of there. Really? You just dropped another one. This time on your side. Dropped on your side, Buck. Oh, well, Simon's here. Let's see. All right, I just gave Simon more peanuts. Where is he? Oh, right there. <laughs> he doesn't know where to run. I know, I have the camera everywhere this morning. I'm trying to get a little bit of everything. And Buck dropped one peanut and an apple by his side. And Simon is finding all the peanuts that I threw him. And now he's probably gonna go rob the one that's by the apple. Yep, because he's getting closer. There's an almond. There's a few almonds on the ground there that Buck dropped. No more peanuts, baby. I'm not going to give the peanuts to him no more. You don't want them more? If you don't want them more, then I'm going to... There you go. No, I just threw it on the ground. You want to lick the bowl? Okay. Good boy. Buck, you still have an apple and an almond that you left on the ground. He left an almond and an apple. I see if Red the Carnival shows up. And the squirrels. Then I would say everybody's here. Let's go back to Thumper. Thumper's already here hanging out. You're so cute, Thumper. And Buck's over here eating. Oh, and Simon's back. Simon's back from bringing his things home. Now he's filling up his cheeks for more stuff that he's finding. Oh, Bluey's here. Hi, Bluey. Oh, Bluey, you found a peanut. Good job. Because I threw some peanuts that way before 
Oh, I need to find a pecan. So Bluey came. Bluey actually found some peanuts that I threw really for Simon, but Simon didn't eat them. But Simon's over here now collecting the peanuts that Buck dropped. There was like three almonds on the ground. So Buck, now you're out of that, those peanuts, because this one is like a little peanut cleaner. So I got Simon the chipmunk here, I got Buck, and I got Thumper. Louie passed by. There's a whole bunch of birds on those trees over there. Buck is eating his food. Let's go back to Thumper. Oh, this tree's making me itchy. Oh, there's a little tree behind me and it's making me like, I'm not gonna come towards you. I'm staying right here. I want them to get scared and think I'm walking towards, cause I'm not, I'm just standing up. Cause this tree, this tree right here, it keeps like tickling my hair and stuff. I'm like, oh my God. And I, I keep feeling like I have like a bug on me. Well, the raccoons ate most of the pizza that my father-in-law offered them yesterday. Simon's back. Simon, you back? They only left one slice, it looks like, out of all the slices. There goes Simon. Simon came back from bringing his stuff home. He already did two rounds of bringing stuff home. And now he's back over here looking for more peanuts. I think he collected all the peanuts. He's still looking for more. And Buck's antlers got extra bigger. When I said his name, his ears moved. <laughs> right, Buck? This is my big boy. It's okay, Thumper. You're okay. It's okay. I think Thumper got scared because I moved a little closer. I'm not gonna bother you. Aw, Thumper looks so cute the way he's like just standing there. He is so cute. Alright, you're probably full. I guess Thumper was full. Because I did throw a lot of corn for him. And here comes Simon back. This little chipmunk is so funny. He's running around like all up here. Trying to find more peanuts and more stuff. I know he collects some corn too, so I did scatter some corn. Oh, he found a cashew just now. He's smart, that little chipmunk. He's finding all the peanuts that I scattered earlier. And I threw them for him before Buck got to the spot. But he didn't find them and now he's finding them. Oh, it's so beautiful outside. It is gorgeous. And it's supposed to get warm today, like really warm. Just finishing up his breakfast. But I'm gonna get going soon. I have a few things I wanna do today, like clean, like projects, like reorganizing stuff, certain things around my house. So I wanna get an early start of the day, doing things. And then by the time I'm like exhausted, where I just wanna pass out. <laughs> So this is like my relaxing time when I hang out with Buck outside. It's like my like, uh, I recalculate my brain. Like with all this like beautiful sounds. I'm like, okay, I'll just stay here, relax a little bit, and then go inside. I usually want my husband or my mother-in-law are with him or my son. I never leave my son up inside the house by himself for me to come here. I would never do that. Uh-uh. Always make sure somebody, <gasps> who does it be? Oh, there's a bee. There's a bee flying around right there. That's so nice out. All right, everyone, I'm gonna get going because I have so much stuff I need to get done, especially now the weather's getting warmer out, you know, like there's like certain rugs, for example, you can't wash like in a washing machine. I have a rug cleaner. But sometimes it's 
it's like so annoying to like clean out all the buckets in the departments of it that I'd rather just bring my rug outside and like hose it down and scrub it and do it that way. So I need to do that to one of my rugs. Stop my spring cleaning. I've been doing a lot of spring cleaning. I want to change my curtains. Because every season, usually I change my curtains in my living room. It's funny because in the winter, you, you would think like, you know, somebody would go darker with their curtains and in the summer, lighter. I do the opposite. I go lighter in the winter so it's not so dark in my house. Because, you know, the way it's not really that sunny days in the house in the winter. It's more cloudy days. So I go lighter with my curtains in the winter time and then in the summertime, I go darker, so if it gets really sunny, I could just put my curtains down and they'll block the sun from coming in. So that's how I do it. I know some people do the opposite around, like, you know, for like spring or summer, they'll put lighter, like decorations, lighter stuff in the house, like lighter curtains, probably, things like that. All right, now I'm going to get going. I know I said that before. <laughs> I'm really getting going. He's stretching right now. That's why his tail's up. He's stretching, big boy. Buck has definitely ate all his corn. He definitely ate all of it. That buck is probably empty right now. <sighs> and something, probably a mole, made a hole there. Oh my God, I gotta cover it. I was gonna put stuff on top of the holes from the moles, cause then they'll be running by my feet. I don't want that, I'm scared. I am scared, I don't want a mole running up my feet. Okay, all right. All right, everyone. I'll be back later this evening with Buck's dinner video. I hope everybody has a great day today. The weather's gorgeous by me. I hope it's gorgeous by you. And me and Buck will both be back later this evening. Ciao for now.